I already did our video on spray transfer, aluminum MIG welding using a push-pull gun. Now we're going to go into a pulse aluminum load for gas metal arc welding. Uh, we're just going to do a lap joint again. Our uh, base metal is 6061 aluminum. Our filler metal is going to be 4043. Uh, we're going to use eighth inch thick material. Uh, the wire is 364 of an inch. Straight argon for our shielding gas. Uh, one of the problems we had when we ran one is it kind of got hot at the end, so we added a heat sink. Um, on the back side of it, it was like an inch thick piece of aluminum, so the heat has somewhere to kind of go rather than stay right in the lap joint. Uh, the difference between pulse and spray transfer is just a program number on the machine. So you go from 71 to 72. This 72 is pulse. All right, the next video we're going to do is going to be pulse on pulse for even thinner stuff. The reason you go to a pulse mode is because the material is a little bit thinner. When we did our spray transfer mode um, 71, we used quarter of an inch thick um, aluminum. Now we're using eighth of an inch, making it a little bit thinner. Um, you got to move really quick with it. Uh, once you get it set right, you can just go straight across. You don't have to do a lot of weaving and things like that. So we'll get out in the lab here and we'll start this. All right, here we are at the welder. We're going to start our pulse now. Uh, so I'll push pull gun again. So again, there's drive rolls in the gun as well as in the machine. Uh, we'll zoom in here and kind of show you what the settings are now on the machine. These are the settings on the machine here. We did the spray transfer video. We we're on 71. That's just the program. Now we're scrolling up to 72. That takes the pulse. We're running 148 uh, inches a minute for wire feed speed. We're on trim now, so 1.0 on trim. Trim is just another form of the uh, voltage. So we'll start uh, burning these in. This is the first one that we did on uh, Pulse. Got a little hot towards the end, so what we did is we just threw a little heat seek on the back. Uh, one inch thick plate of aluminum to kind of absorb that. You can see at the end it got a little hot. Look at the next one we did. This is the next one we did with the Pulse mode. With a heat seek on the back. Just came out a little smoother. Still got a little hot at the end. Thin stuff though, it tends to do that. 